The Oasis of Blessings Assembly Church, where Vice President-elect Mutale Nalumango is a reverend, has released her so she can focus on national matters. Church founder Bishop Max Nalumango, who is also Miss Nalumango's husband, has confirmed this today during worship service. Ms. Nalumango has been a reverend at the Oasis of Blessings Assembly, a church she co-founded with her husband. Here is a report. <laughs> It was a joyous moment at the Oasis of Blessings Church in Lusaka today. They gathered to bless and release church co-founder, now Vice President-elect Mutale Nalumango to the state. The release is with blessings as she embarks on her journey to save the country. Church founder Bishop Max Nalumango has described the wife, who is the Vice President-elect, as a dedicated woman of God, apart from being a politician. See what God has done for her. As a church, we want to release her so that she concentrates on her new job, on her profession, amen, as a church. So that's why we are having this last segment. And Bishop Peter Mdenda of Mazabuka's World Power Resurrection Ministries International encouraged Miss Nalumango to serve the country in accordance with the will of God. The sun shall not smite you by day, nor the moon by night. The Lord shall preserve thy soul from all evil in that office. The Lord shall preserve thy going out and thy coming in and thy coming in from this day forth and forever. We know that God will guide you. In an interview later, Ms. Nalumango has said you endeavor to serve the people of Zambia diligently and according to the will of God. I am God's mission. So I will speak to the people of Zambia that we will endeavor, I will endeavor to serve and serve well so that I do not forget where I've come from, so that glory can go to the living God himself. The church has also gifted the vice president-elect with a Bible, among other things. Patricia Mapiki, ZNBC News, in Lusaka. Remember to hit the like button, place a comment, and subscribe. Thank you so much for watching.